Hi everyone. I look for a lot of the different secrets and mysteries from all around the world, looking for the coming of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, Emmanuel, the Son of God, who was risen from the dead and took all the sins of the world away. Now the world elite, the Illuminati, the Freemasons, and even the spiritual realms that are all around us, they leave their signs and secrets right in front of us, in symbolism. And on our channel, we bring all this back to the Word of God and show how we're nearing the end of days. Well, today is Monday, May 1st, 2017. We are showing about a lot of the information that is showing that we're nearing the time of Revelation 12, when the dragon will rise and come after the woman, and when this birth will happen, and that this dragon is coming for World War III, also known as the Revelation 13 beast out of the sea. This new world order system is going to be very racist and it will be very white power oriented. Please don't be racist in any way about this. We're all stuck in this terrible mess together. But these signs are coming out over and over again. It will be a type of police state that is about to rise up and these signs are being shown to us over and over again. In a Dallas suburb, this one young man, 15 years old, was leaving a house party where the police had been called to see about underage drinking. And as he was, they were all leaving in their car, in their car, just driving away, the police actually shot him to the car with a rifle and killed this one young boy here at 15 years old named Jordan Edwards. This has a lot of things to do in the Bible in the time of the crossing, just as with Jordan and the River Jordan and with the child that is supposed to be born at the end times. See Revelation 12? As she brought forth a man-child who was to rule all nations with a rod of iron, and her child was caught up unto God and to his throne. And that is who the dragon is coming after. Now that doesn't mean it has to be this child in particular, or that the child will be white or black. But the signs of this new world order rising is right in front of us. It has a lot to do with Putin, and even with the Catholic Church, and even Obama. Obama has sold everyone out. So for anyone in the black race that thinks Obama might help, he wants chaos and he has sold out to be part of this new world order. Do you see the Pope and the Russian Orthodox Church and Islam? And there is Obama right there with him and there is the mark of the beast right below him. That is a person with the mark of the beast. They want something to happen to Donald Trump and to Donald Trump's tower. And that will usher in the red armies in the new world order. See it all right there? And until the new Israel and Jerusalem comes about. This is a picture of the Revelation 13 beast out of the sea. It only lasts 42 months. But it is going to be very racist towards the black race. That is what has been shown. Just as right here with this shooting. Right here. We're going to go over and map this out. But right here is a mural from the Bank of America, and it shows when the woman gives birth that you can see the Black Lives Matter group over here rioting, and the police, and a disease will be released. And then martial law and the New World Order with the Catholic Church rising up. See them versus the black race. See how they want something to happen? This is supposedly a meteor or the Large CERN Hadron Collider opening, the Revelation 18 millstone that comes down at the end times. See all of them there? See Obama right with Russia and it has the feet of the bear. So let's go map something out. If everything is going by scripture then we should be able to go over to this area and it should show the woman, the dragon, and the birth all coming as the Revelation 13 beast rises out of the sea. It's going to show all of that right there. This happened at the 12300 block of Barron Drive, right here. The woman is seen to look like a dog. It represents the star systems and even the dog star Sirius. But that represents the woman. Can you see the dog? Right there. That represents the woman and the birth of the children. All of us the ascension. You see that right there? So you see how all of the world is as, a, is as a matrix. Trust in the Lord Jesus Christ. It's all going to be okay. 
can you see the dragon sitting at the woman's feet? And there appeared a great wonder in heaven, a woman clothed with the sun and the moon under her feet. And there appeared another wonder in heaven, and behold, a great red dragon having seven heads and ten horns. See all the heads of the beast? That's all the different heads. See all of them together. Now the dragon should be sitting right at her feet. There's the dragon. Right there. See, this all by the line. Stop your video if you have to. There you go. Perfect. So you can see the dragon sitting at her feet, ready to consume the children, exactly as we've shown. So that's why that one boy was shot. The police and the New World Order police state that's coming represents this dragon, as we've shown, the many-headed beast. It even has a lot to do with the spirit of Adolf Hitler coming back. Remember this picture, the dragon and the dog. Now let's go show this quickly and show that the spirit of Adolf Hitler will be going into the Pope. And don't forget, Obama has sold everyone out. He wants to make himself look like he's a savior for everyone, but he's given the keys to everything, to the Pope and to Russia. Even if they act like they're not friends, they're all involved. There he is, right there. And there's the mark of the beast coming. He wants to be the part of Islam. When you have Islam, the Russian Orthodox Church, and the Catholic Church all blended together. They want to get rid of Protestants and then they want to have Islam and the Catholic Church all in control of everything and their new religion and some Hindu stuff involved in here it's shown. But that's the basics of it. They want to get rid of the Protestants and they don't have a very good plan for the black race it seems. This guy is very white power oriented. He's only letting Obama stay around. So let's go show some. And Donald Trump's going to lead everybody right towards this too. It's all a big domino effect. He represents Aaron and the golden calf. There's the mark of the beast right there. So just know all of that. The only guy that can help us is Jesus Christ. Let's show this quickly on another glyph. This is an ancient glyph called the Hereford Map of Mundi, my, mapped out by the Knights Templars. We have to trust in Jesus. This shows at this time that Jesus Christ will be coming in the clouds to sit on the throne of the world and to judge the world from up here. See him sitting on the throne of the world? And he will turn the world like a wheel called the wheel of the great tribulation. And the persecution of the saints and the Christians and everything will be going on. He will even let the, the mark of the beast have its time. And he will collect the souls the, the ones that go to him and the ones that don't. You can see right here mapped out Michael the Archangel casting down this stone, the red bull, the little horn. That is the dragon. See how it's smashing right into the dog? And then these two domes will go. This was represented the other day when the church of St. Mark and St. George were blown up in Egypt and then the Pope immediately went down to Egypt at that point, representing this, these two big events coming. This will also even be earthquakes and everything coming. It's a very big event in the Bible. These two arrows right here represent an 11.5 earthquake or bigger for this woman and this ship of oil for the wise virgin Christians. And then you can see right here the spirit of Adolf Hitler at that time as these big explosive events go on, you can see Adolf Hitler going into the Pope. Right there. And they give out what's called this new Eucharist, which is in Daniel 8, the new host. And it is poison. It's right there. It is pure poison. They are going to kill the whole planet. That's the plan for most of what's going on. For their chosen people, they won't eat the poison. But they're going to give most of the world this thing here. It's talked of in Daniel 8. May God have mercy on us all. 
So you can see it all right there, right in front of us. Perfect. That represents the same event we just showed. It's called the birth in the Bible. So there you can see it all right there. And that's why the boy Jordan was killed. And it represents this police state and this dragon coming. So look, I'm sitting right there at the belly. Confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead, and you'll be saved. Hallelujah. Thank you very much, everybody. And my God have mercy on all of us as the end times begin. Hallelujah. Don't be racist. This thing is going to be coming to do the mark of the beast to white, black, yellow, red. It's going to be coming after everyone. And it wants people to fight each other. This thing actually wants a type of race war. It wants, it wants the black race to start hating on the whites, and it wants the whites to hate on the blacks. It's just part of it. Just as when people should have noticed that during Obama's term, racial tension had never been so bad. Obama, it, things were very bad everywhere around him. Everywhere he went, there was war and strife, and I mean all the stuff that went on in the Middle East when they killed the uh, when they killed the ambassador Stevens in Benghazi. That was a direct sign that Obama is going to betray everyone. That you can see right here. See, this represents the USA being destroyed. That's Trump Tower being blown up by the Russians and China all coming. Confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead, and you'll be saved. Hallelujah. This means that you have an afterlife. Let's escape from this dragon, and I'll see all of you at the wedding feast of the Lamb. Hallelujah.